Many children associate Christmas with Santa, Christmas trees, presents, but it's important to remember the true meaning of Christmas. With the goal of sharing the Christmas story in a way children won't forget, Jim Stafford wrote a children's book. And here it is, and here's Jim to tell us more. This is such a clever way to tell the nativity story. It's through the eyes of a, a little mouse. Right. How did you come up with that? Well, the thing is, when you're writing a, a child's story, you need to come down to their level. You have to give them something they can understand and something they can relate to. And thanks to S Uncle Sylvester, this has happened. <laughs> Uncle Sylvester, the, uh, the, the mouse who is, he's kind of traveling along with the holy couple as they are going to Bethlehem. Great. And, and that's how you've told the story. But the illustrations are really sweet. Now, how did uh, those come about? Well, a member of our church, Linda Bray Warner, uh, decided that, that she would do the illustrations for me. Mm -hmm. And she did an awesome job, a very awesome job. There's, a, there's another one, yeah. They're beautiful, they're very, but they're simple. There's something a, a child could even copy right. if they wanted to, to draw themselves. Um, so how long has this been a, a dream of yours to have this book well, published? Well, I've, I've thought about it a long time. In fact, uh, it was in my early uh, teens before I realized what Christmas was all about. All I thought it was was Christmas trees, Santa Claus, presents. But I found out that the one and only reason for the Christmas season is our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And it has meant so much more to me ever since. And you want to share that with children everywhere. Uh, how can folks get a copy of the book? Where are they available? Well, I, I, uh, I have an address a here that, that they can they can send to okay and in the prices if, if i do a, a church signing or something like that it's 2214 if they send off to it and i mail them i have to charge postage mm -hmm. which would be 25 dollars and uh i i live at 5400 uh, laurel lake drive apartment 21 201 east and uh, they could send it there, and, and I'll be glad to, to uh, uh, send them a copy. Well, it's a delightful story, and it's a different take on the nativity story and something I know parents will enjoy sharing with their kids at the holiday season. Well, see, I have adult friends that really like the story, <laughs> That's too. That's right. Well, I enjoyed reading yeah. it myself. Uh, Jim, thank you so much. This has been really a pleasure to us. We've tried to do this now for a year. Yes, we have. Uh, and yes. so it's, it's wonderful to finally get you, uh, get you on Central Texas Living to be able to talk about this wonderful little book, The Birth of Jesus Christ Through the Eyes and Ears of My Great Uncle Sylvester the Mouse. Thank you so much. Thank it you is so a much, pleasure. Jim. God bless you. Oh, you too. You too.